Hi guys, welcome to the Quaker Beagle. As always, I'm Dave Cash. I'm in a car, and this is a video. In case you didn't know. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. I really, really appreciate it. Today's video is going to be a brief introduction to Discogs, specifically our page on Discogs. But if you don't know what Discogs is, if you've never been introduced before, I'll very, very quickly give you a, a brief overview. Discogs is an online marketplace dedicated to the sale of vinyl, CDs and tapes. It's also a great information resource because you can find out all about many, many records, including some very, very rare ones. You can find out an average price for them, or at least what they've been selling for on Discogs. You can find out about specific pressings, versions, special editions. You can even find out about the inserts that should have been inside them. And you can find out if you've got those inserts or not. It's a great thing if you're looking to move on a record collection, but you don't know enough about them. It even gives you information on local record shops uh, called the Vinyl Hub. And it also gives you information on how to grade your records. I think it's the it's called the gold standard um, that, the, that they use on Discogs. I might be wrong about that. So anyway, we do sell on Discogs. We have quite a lot of uh, singles and EPs on there at the moment. All very, very rare and obscure. The kind that we wouldn't really put into the shop down, not just vintage, because it wouldn't reach a wide enough audience. So we put them online and offer them internationally because somewhere out there, there will be a buyer for every record. And we've done quite well selling on there at the moment. I also buy on there quite a bit, really. The most recent purchase for me was, oh, um, the Rolling Stones Aftermath. I got a really, really early pressing of that. And I was absolutely delighted. I love the Rolling Stones and that's my favorite record by far. So that's it really, but it does lead me into the singles that we do sell down at Not Just Vintage. You may have noticed we have a small selection there, but that's about to get much, much bigger. I've got hundreds of records, um, seven inch vinyls and EPs going in over the next few days. I'm rearranging to make room for them. Uh, and I'm also gonna be putting some new memorabilia and things in there as well. So if you haven't been down to Not Just Vintage, please do go and take a look. If you've been there already, you'll know it's not the biggest unit in the shop, but it's not the size that counts. It's what you do with it that matters. And I do quite well with it, if you don't mind me saying. We have a really good re uh, turnover of stock. We've only got a couple of hundred records in most of the time, uh, not including CDs, uh, rarities, not including the damaged ones, and so on and so forth. So do go in, take a look. We've got loads on offer. It's 136 Oxton Road. I'll put a, just up here, I'll put the address. And I'll also leave a link in the description to their Facebook page. That's it, really. Um, nice and concise, all wrapped up nicely. And I hope you have a jolly nice day. Don't forget to subscribe here on YouTube and hit that little bell icon to make sure you're notified whenever we upload a new video. But also don't forget, we are on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and as you know, we are on Discogs. And that's it. Take care, have a great day. Bye-bye. <laughs>